It's been a difficult day today, and unfortunately, I lost my head. <laughs> After being blindfolded, I asked my audience member to think of three numbers and to write them down. Yep, done. Now take your seat and a round of applause for Keith, please, ladies and gentlemen. And then Psychic Susie took over. And now using my psychic powers, the first number, I'm thinking unlucky for some 13. Ooh. It worked! Because of course what the audience couldn't hear was this. Eight. Is it number eight? Thanks to my precisely positioned audio spotlight and my accomplice hidden in the rafters. Just one more number to get, but that volume level had to be just right. It's 30. Visualise, visualise. It's 30. It's... It's 30! Three zero! Thank you very much. Could you take my blindfold off? Ooh, that was a tricky one. Thank you very much. I done it, and my audience hadn't spotted a thing. Thank you all for coming. Just remember, be careful what you're thinking. You never know who's reading your mind. But had I fooled the expert? So your verdict then, please. How did I do? Well, you're a natural, aren't you? Oh. <laughs> No, seriously, I'm not just saying it, but that, that was brilliant. You know, I watched the rest of the audience and they were totally fooled. That was, you're going to get burnt as a witch if you're not careful. Now. That, was, <laughs> that was seriously great. You know, both tricks were fantastic. The second one, I'm not even sure. No, no, that's what I'm doing. Really? Yeah, yeah, but Yuri Geller's made a 40-year career out of less than that. So, seriously, top marks on that. Thank you very much. Do that? Oh, I don't know how I did that. <laughs> good, oh, seriously, you both did really well, though, because you're used to presenting, but to kind of be thinking about the tricks as well. And particularly Jason had a, a real hassle there because he had to improvise and fill in while they did the trick. Uh, and Susie obviously had to learn the script and, and lose her head at the same time. <laughs> and be blindfold. As regards who won, it's not just about the entertainment and showmanship. Obviously, it's about the trick itself. Yeah. And the answer to who won is in the cards. Oh. So, I'm going to look for a card in here that will represent the winner. I'm going to go. It's a male card. It's got a J. Oh. However, it's got Susie's name. Oh. 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 Excellent. Oh. Well done, Susie. <laughs> And the, the reason is really because I quite honestly didn't know exactly how you did that second trick there. Because uh, I was thinking it must be kind of either someone behind the chair whispering or you've got a hidden earpiece and it wasn't either. So, <gasps> so we managed uh, yeah. to fool the great Paul Zennon. No,